Hello friends and welcome to Let's Play Hotable Boyfriend Part 12? Yeah? 12? I think we're on 12. Anyway, uh, this time around we're going for the teacher bird ending, so uh... Yay! I'm just excited because after the teacher bird there's only uh, a few more endings. <laughs> I think there's only, including this one, I think there might only be like four more in mix. Three or four? Which is nice, because that means I'm almost done with this game. Uh, and then I'm going to stop playing for a while and replace it with something else. Uh, before Holiday Star comes out. Or before I start doing Hotiful, or Holiday Star. Hotiful Star. Yeah, I'll just skip through all of the introduction parts as per usual. Uh... Teacher Bird only has one ending, so uh, hopefully this bird will, or <laughs> this uh, part will be shorter than the last one. Uh, because who really cares, Quick? I know I don't. Get through all the drama. Uh, all right, here we go. Some creepy Dr. Bird. I think he's next on the achievements list. Uh, that's how I'm doing this from now on, it's just going based off of the list of achievements. I hope so. Alright. Well, we join the student council. Again. I think we pick a different position. Alright, so, uh, let's see, Teacher Bird teaches math, so let's go to math class. I guess my way on As well you should. Alright, let's see what to do. See with all this. Alright, whatever, Saki. I know you're deep dark secret and you love music. Maybe he's French. I'll be... Let's see, Vice President went for him. I don't know what Treasure does, I'll find out eventually. Let's go for Clerk. <laughs> then Vice President, very well. So I wasn't expecting Vice President. Okay, so it doesn't really matter then. Does it? Is it relaxing to sit in a cave? Whatever. Alright, we talk to Kazuta. Most of the freak is an over yet. Um, I wanted to talk to you. No, why not talk to them? Do you not want to talk to me? That's not me yet. You know, funny girl. Kiss again. And he fell asleep. I don't said anything yet. I wonder if he has some sort of illness. Right. Well, we will continue with going to math class. Should we review the basics a little more? Whatever. I don't understand why you could fall for the teacher bird anyway. Sports festival's right around the corner. And Buddy loves sports! Today's sports festival. What should I do? Um. I'm gonna play by the race. You too. Once again, it's good to be Just for the human turbines in. That and you'll do this time. One day you can surpass me. I'd love to see that. Oh, that's nice. Teacher Bird complimented me. Yay! Whatever. <sighs> um. Room 
Hillary. You can eat it from over here. I came here to skip class. I think hear your voices to like uh get in good with him. You know, I'm pretty sure he's like some sort of like mad scientist political bird who wants to kill me. Back to math. I have no charisma, look at that. Okay, so I'm just asleep. How can I sleep? <laughs> I mean, sometimes they're one and the same, right? It's time about to battle, let's go, make a wish. I wish to rule the world from the ship. I mean, doesn't everyone? Is that you? Kip, stay here. Alright, we finally get to find out what happened when you say yes, please. Walk me home, teacher, babe. That's creepy, sorry. Let's see if we can stream to sleep with Emily home, but we are not sure. This is very nice. I like this one. Wonderful, that place I'm not here. Wonderful indeed. He looks a little sad. I'm soon. See you tomorrow. Don't forget your homework. Aww. Maybe he comes from like a broken home or something. Watch that be the actual truth. Like watch him like, it turns out like he comes from a broken home. Or like, he's just gotten a divorce and he's homeless. What if he's homeless? Let's just skip all of this. Skip forward. I'm very smart in this version of the game. Well done. It's the last day. It's summertime. I'm late. Let's start here. Maybe I should stand up to him. Nah. Standing up to him makes him like me. We don't want that to happen. You already went through your storyline, bird. Now I don't care about you. Alright. Let's go for it. She has an ending too, the like biker bird. Wait, she has two endings, but we already got one of her endings. So that's easier. I'll forget. Nobody needs a job. I mean, I need a job, but, you know, whatever. I can skip lectures. Alright, let's go do the summer festival. Let's invite... We can invite our teacher. That's kind of weird. We need something. Today's the summer festival. Want to go with us? I need my friends so get early. We plenty of fun with you. It just feels kind of creepy, right? Like, I'm in high school, and I don't know what year of high school I'm in. Um, just for my sanity's sake, let's assume that I'm in my senior year of high school. And this is all somewhat legal. You okay, sir? I'm still with you. I'm not used to cats. Fireworks! Oh, yes. You studied in Dex Color Reactions. <laughs> Reactions to the in middle school, copper dates for you, it's in the day. Oh, that's like the thing we did where we like dipped the sticks in the chemical and then we lit them on fire. That was pretty. That's how fireworks worked. So beautiful. Let's go. Your eyes are even more beautiful, sir. And he's asleep. That looked pretty well, but I guess he gets even sleepier than usual if the sun goes down. Wait. I think the girl is supposed to get told she's prettier than. The knight, not the man. Oopsie. Awkward. I don't know. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, right. Okay, uh, let's help him. Good, I'm getting new storylines. That's nice. Thank you. I'll go make us some tea. So, I spent the morning greeting testing the air conditioned staff like a proper little lady. This tea is very good. It has mango in it. I do like some tea. Oh my god. Like, 
tangent here. I mean, not really a tangent, kind of a tangent. So like mango flavored green tea. So good. It's my favorite, it's my favorite tea. Besides like Texas sweet tea, which is basically just like sugar and a few tea leaves in water. It's best. So good. I love tea. Ironically, I don't like Earl Grey tea that much. <laughs> Uh, for someone whose username pretty much everywhere is make it all the way. I'm not a big fan of it. Stay folk. Focus Ed. Focus Ed. Focus Ed. I don't know anyone named Ed. I kind of wish I did. Oh well. Is that a student ID? Who's ID is it? Should I go find the classroom? Alright. Let's see what happens next. What's up? Hello, did you forget to turn your phone? I found someone inside the car. Thank you. I can take care of it. Ugh, nothing. You just... You did find this today, right? What's that? Yes, in the corridor. Oh, right. This is the Fallen Angel ID card. Isn't that a bit dusty? Anyway, I'll take care of it. Alright, cool. We should go to math class again. This game is boring. That, that's kind of the worst possible thing a game can be. Like, if it's buggy but entered what in the world? I'll get back to that topic about games later. <laughs> is there a down pillow or something? You have to what? You didn't clean up properly this year? It's molten season, so well, one little breezy looks like this unless we make sure to keep everything clean. Good morning, everyone. Sure, quick ones are in order for you. I'm done cleaning in the morning. This atmosphere is quite distracting. Who's supposed to clean yesterday? Oko-san! <laughs> that should Poko get you fulfill the duty given to you? Come on, arguing won't solve anything. It'll be easy if we all pitch in. So we swabbed the room down before homeroom. <laughs> you swabbed it down? This has some awkward words in it. Not enough for food. A futon blade? You can make a nice pillow. Certainly is more than usual. Did they come in the window, perhaps? Huh? Sir, um, did you spill some chlorine on yourself? Chlorine? You don't use that kind of detergent. But, um, you really smell like it. Oh, that would be the bleach. Bleach? Sir, are you one of those degenerates who bathes with bleach powder? No, I do soft and got stuck in the washing machine, that's all. What? Sir, please be careful. So, like, are all... They're all, like, regular-sized birds, I'm fairly certain. I'm confused. I'm... I'm just confused about the mechanics of this world, quite frankly. I don't have anything to do, so I guess I'll look around. I can't choose. Hmm. Oh, I'm talking like, Hey, this is new. You said this car, huh? Yep. Could you maybe help with the reception desk? We're getting a lot of people to be accepted. I shall meet out disruptions. Information and directions I can only avoid. Who are the heads? See the top of the road. Right from the skulls of my phone? What sort of wacky crap is going through this girl's head? But that's not what I would have said. I would have been like, no, screw you. I mean, I would have said that, but in my head I would have been like, no, screw you. I'm just a little. <sighs> It's kind of boring to be trying to fall in love with a bird who always sleeps. What do you do? What do you do? Like, how do you not notice that? You see nothing peculiar about these numbers? Nothing at all. There's a statistical deviation as well as students on data from the past few years. I'd hope to get someone to start thinking about it. It's the life of our students. Really? Sorry, I couldn't help them. I'll... Side with Kazukai. That's not very nice. What do you want? Hello, Tosuka. What is it? I'm sorry, I give you my recorder instead of my homework. So, you did the thing. Here's the workbook. Thank you, sir. Sorry, sir. Teacher, the pupil. How rude. Okay, I'm not a... Whatever the word is for somebody who's constantly falling asleep randomly. 
true real life. Makes me want cereal. Like I'll go home and spend- Why is this capitalized? Lifetime? Yoko, hi Yoko. You know what Mr. Miller gave us, right? This book. Why do you ask? He left his phone in the staff room. It's already left, but you know how slow he can use. If you hurry, you can catch him before he gets home. Sure, I'm not doing anything. See all his species? How he spends 97. I assume that's meant to be a percent sign, not to question marks. <laughs> hmm. It's a paper fell out of his case. What's this? It's a photo. A photo of a bird? But I can't see the face at all. It's been scribbled all over it. I can even tell it's a picture of a bird. Maybe I should pretend I didn't see it? Sir! Hello. Where are you going? You look like you're in a hurry. Sir, you forgot your cell phone. So you did. Thank you for coming after me. No problem. Um, what should I do? What's up with that picture, bro? I'll be nosy. I guess that. Don't worry about it. I felt that's something we need to. Ooh, new music. But I'm curious. It was almost completely left out. Yes. Because I left it out. The truth is out there. <laughs> uh, Exiles reference. His head in the scene, doesn't he? Ooh! New backgrounds. It's a different side of the hallway. Where's my phone? I'm really looking at Daily Portal Z. What is it? Hold on. Okay, so Daily Portal Z is like... I'll just save it here. Uh, Daily Portal Z is like a news website. Um, so not very interesting. Maybe I left it in the cat lab. The door is open. There it is! Did it work on the bench or with that side? Were you on me? Did I just talk to my phone? It's creepy. Did I just fall? To talk to it? You again? How'd you like the purpose aside from metal with me? No, I... What is he even doing here? It came out of the chemistry prep room, right? Not enough to just go in the lab. What are you doing? I left something behind. Did you see anything? There? I'm asking if you saw anything. What are you... What is he talking about? Would it be a problem if I had seen something? There you go. Can I ask a thing of you? Uh, yes, what is it? Could you bring the flies from the black room? The black ones on the desk. Isn't this the proper room right here? They are somewhat heavy for you. Me? But I'm sure you will have no problem with them. Would you mind? Uh, no. I'm not sure I could get away with saying no. I'll just do what he feels. He's creepy. I don't want to follow up with him. The doctor creeps me out. Oh my god, he's trying to murder me. Feeling fluffy hurted. Fluffy, and I didn't tell anyone I was going here. Ah, oh, somebody help me! The doctor left me in here. Why did he do that? There's no reason to, unless he, he thinks I saw something I shouldn't. Shutting me up or removing the evidence. That's probably it. I'm in despair. This evil doctor will probably be coming back with a cleaver. Something has left me in despair. Not sure I can make it out the window, but I have to get out of here quickly. How can I? Footsteps coming closer. I have to hide. But, but there's no way to hide in here. Sorry, sorry, please don't. Huh? Kazuya! Mr. Nanaki. But even worse, it's coming from here when you bang on the door. It's not good. Doctor isn't a punching bag. I think I can hear a halo of a red sun. Crack the fear angels. I'm alive! There's some dangerous things in here, so don't come in without asking, okay? I didn't come in of my own court, the doctor. That's right, I asked you to. You did? Indeed, I am truly sorry. I completely forgot I'd asked you to get something. I locked her in and walked off. You locked the door as soon as I walked in here. Who are you, Clyde Weiring? Who is Clyde? Hold on.
Clive Wearing is some British dude who has retrograde amnesia, lacks the ability to form the memories, and also cannot recall aspects of his past memories, frequently believing that he has only recently awoken from a coma. Okay. Fun facts with Hot Awful Boyfriend. The more you know. Is that it? Well then. This whole thing stinks of ill doing, Mr. Nanaki, but the doctor said it was an accident. I think it might be best if you went home as soon as possible this time if you had to get stuck so quickly. That is true. I wanted to leave early, but then all this happened. Well, then I'll head home now. Stay safe. We'll have a career plan survey tomorrow, so don't forget the printout from earlier today. That was creepy. She's a very honest, nice girl, isn't she? She is a little bit restless. I agree completely. Anyway, I shall excuse myself now. Goodbye, doctor. Yes? That was a little sloppy. You failed to pay sufficient attention to your surroundings. What's happening? What sort of thing will be the death of you, you know? Just kidding. Excellence like that happened to everyone. You remember to come let her out in the end. Don't worry about it. Yes. Thank you, Professor. What is happening? Is Teacher Bird evil? Teacher Bird's evil. Calling it now, Teacher Bird is evil. This guy, sir, you rank top of the year this time. Yay, I'm top of the year! Haha, <laughs> suck it, Sakuya! Aw, oh, he's growling at me. Yippee! Kai yay! Mother clucker. Get it? Because it's. Because they're birds and chickens cluck. Yeah? I don't know, it was funny in my head. But like one for fulfillment in school. I'm going for a professor bird. Skipping past. Oh, hey. Mr. Nanaki, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Did you get a fortune? Fortunately, I seem to have done the chicken of ill omen. Alright. There are only like two different ones anyway. Bye bye. Happy New Year. The third term. Let's go to Ligon in time. Let's buy Country Millet or Millet. I don't really know which one it is. Ah! Hey, let's give him some beans. So I wasn't sure which to get, but ah, Millet seeds. I like them very much. I've enjoyed them for a long time. Looking back at Millet. Mm, such a nice shit. And he's asleep. You really sure you have to get this to me? Yes, sir. I'm hunter-gatherer and never goes back on her word. She keeps talking about how she's a hunter-gatherer, right? But we have never seen her once hunt or gather. I think I'll have to think about it. So he wandered off towards the staff room, a gentle smile on his face. I'm glad he liked them. Is that it? Hello? This was almost over in a few short days. I'm only a sophomore? Okay, this is creepy. One thing I need to do. Do the do with my teacher. <laughs> that was a joke. It's about your career point, don't worry, you're still a sophomore. You don't have to decide for a few minutes. I don't know how school works in Japan. I should, considering how much anime I watch, but I don't. Do, sir, I like you. Is that, is that alright? You say the strangest thing, Jessica. I like you too. You're kind, smart, you work hard. I, I didn't mean it like that. Hmm. Listen, I'm no longer able to love another teacher. It's not your fault, Jessica. I'm sorry. What does that even mean, bro? He's not remember. It's all what, sir. Oh no. Yes, sir, I didn't mean to. I knew you wouldn't lie. I suppose I should tell you. It's a photo of the most important bird in my life. Thought we could like to do anything just the two of us. Oh my god, is he gay? Is he gay for the doctor bird? And I was alone. I've changed after that. I stopped caring about a lot of things. I can never forget. I forget our life. I promise you. But I'm not sure how to say this. It was a bit quit every day. I realized I couldn't tell anyone. Couldn't tell if I felt love when I saw it face or if I felt hatred. I think losing someone dear is painful for everyone. After a while, I didn't stand to see it anymore. So you. That's right. But even as I tried to forget, it's part of me didn't want to. See now, right? Why I don't want to love again? No, love I felt. I soared into resentment. 
and then forcing all that hatred onto one person. I think it's better to love everyone around you just enough that you won't regret losing me. That's too sad. You don't agree? I love your kindness, sir. But when I see that hand spring pain, I have to wonder if there isn't a better way. But by the way, there's one more thing I should tell you. Yeah? That photo. It's gone now. I burned it. Eh? And you saw it. Made me think about things again. I never would have shown it to anyone, so I was rather shaken. We both knew that one of us would have gone one day, and either one of us would have wanted the other to mourn. So as I looked at the photo, I thought it was better, better to put it away. So I burned it. Sort of. As an apology for defacing it like that. So as an apology for defacing it, you destroyed it. That's weird. So my teachers in English always look up me. That doesn't have anything to do with it! <laughs> but I understand that you don't want to forget her, sir. I have an idea. I will be waiting here at this school forever. If after you've grown up a little, you still feel the same way, I'll be here for you. Oh, thank God, it's not creepy. <laughs> it's slightly less creepy. Shall we grow up into a wonderful person, Jessica? So let's wait until then. Wait until you're no longer jail bait. Graduating, growing up, and then coming back here. That would be another story. Don't know what he will say to me on that day. Don't know what I will feel or what he will feel, but right now I am truly happy. That was lame. Sorry, that was lame. Ugh. I think I need to take a longer break from this game. I don't know if I should take a longer break, or if I should just, like, run through it as quickly as possible. But make him- oh, look, it's sleep bird. Anyway, achievement unlocked. Achievement unlocked! I'm confused. What is this? What's the gallery? Oh, it's just- it's pictures of things. Okay. And what is the archive? What in the world? Okay. Goodwill Ambassador. Um, underground, what is happening? What does that mean? Reference bird deceased. Chosen to look into a party agent who has in trade school operating freely for the time being. A number of incoming clues are presumed to be quite fascinating, but possibly please examine the details in the attached documents. I do not think you will post me. I can't. Since that nosy girl kind of, I do not think I will find any answers like this. So perhaps it's time to which will just as well back then, back then, back when, Aves, High City bombing. But guarded by human experience. Immediately afterwards, the half party spawned the Earth extremist organization. Okay, um, let's agree to not come back there until I've gotten all the other endings. Anyway. I hope you've enjoyed Let's Play How to Publish in Part 12. Um, if you haven't, that's fine, because I didn't really enjoy it either. It's the truth, okay. Um, subscribe for more videos, like if you did enjoy it, unlike me. Um, also, Chick Flickuary is coming up uh, next month. Again, in case you've forgotten, that is the month of February, in which I watch one Chick Flick every week, and then make sort of a vlog reviewy thing about it. Um, last year was a thing. So, uh, hopefully this year will be a thing. Obviously no repeats, which means that this year the notebook has even better of a chance to, uh, force me to watch it. Uh, anyway, we'll see. And I will see you next time in whatever Let's Play I happen to be doing then. Peace out. Enjoy your life free of bird love. Bye.